Good afternoon YouTube, uh, this is now the afternoon of the 1st September uh, This morning I showed you a video of my um, new check valve which I got for America and um, I'd like to say to Travis that supplied to me, he's been very helpful on the emails um, I didn't know, I haven't researched them actually, I didn't know I needed them It's uh, what they would call a uh, flame arista and I've sort of built one today um, I've used stainless steel wool inside here um, packed it in real tight, apparently the flame needs to be retarded back with one of these things and then the compression from that would then make this valve work and stop the actual flame from going back into the uh, bubbler here. I built a new bubbler today, a bit smaller size, I'm going to give it another go. Again I'm going to stand well back and uh, just see if this homemade flame rest I've made works. So, um, there's my new uh, homemade flame arrestor valve on <laughs> Kai. Uh, there's a valve I got from eBay today, so that's still working. I'll just weight it down the top of this lid with some hammers so it keeps it compressed still. Uh, if it does pop, it'll just blow the top off this time. I'm not, I'm doubtful this is going to work anyway, um, but I say I, this uh, flame arrest I've made with stainless steel wool packed inside it should do the trick. Okay, so here goes. There's the. Uh, New valve and spark power, and let's just see what happens. Five, four, three, two, one. It's working. The valve works. <laughs> yes, it's working. Wow. Thank God for that. Right, we'll do one more, two more goes. One, five, four, three, two, one. Good. Now, that works. A treat. And great. I'll take it apart now and show you what's inside it anyway, guys. Um, I was so doubtful. This is just, I just made this myself this afternoon. Uh, bits I've had in the shed, so um, let's take it apart and show you how it works. Okay, so this is the arrest, uh, flame arrest that I made today. Um, what's inside is simple. It's stainless steel wool, which I've crammed in one end of this uh, fitting, stuck it down there with a screwdriver and rammed it in. Same with the other side as well, and then same with the middle. And I've just done them up together, tighten them up obviously with a spanner and, and that's it. So th this is, a, from this experiment today guys, um, I learned the hard way, you need to have one of these before, so this is going to be um, in between your air filter and the um, flashback arrester, then the bubbler, okay? <laughs> you can see from my previous video how important these things are now um, and it works a treat. Okay, um, the actual stainless steel wood you can get from any hardware store, it's just this stuff you would use for scrubbing the, in the dishes with. Um, you must get stainless steel, obviously you don't get steel wool, but stainless steel, yeah, whatever it's going to be. But anyway, that's what's in the pack anyway. Um, so I'm really pleased with that now. Uh, and the guy that sold me the, the flashback on the eBay, um, you know, I have said to him that uh, thanks for, for, for his feedback on telling me what, what, to, what I needed to get this thing finished. And I really appreciate that. And uh, his flashback arrestor it works perfectly fine, as you can see, with the right um, things used with it, in conjunction with it. Okay? Thanks again. Have a good day. Speak to you again.